Hello everybody, and welcome back to Resident Evil. Whatever this game is called again at the end of it. I forgot. <laughs> yeah. So, now we're inside the sub of the Umbrella Sub. And so, inside that medical kit, you'll find a purple compound. And you'll find all kinds of healing items, ammo, and everything else like this. And also, inside the sub, because, you know, it's Umbrella. They don't know that zombies infest the area, as we find out less bits of diamond armor, and then we find all the ammo that we're gonna need to, well, ammo up. So, what you wanna do is, though, try your best to avoid all the zombies as best you can, and try to gather all the ammunition you can, mm -hmm. as best as possible. There's gonna be zombies everywhere, there's gonna be the green ones with the crowbars. There's going to be blue ones with crowbars. Bastards. And there's also going to be the B.O.W. He's here as well. But unfortunately, you don't have to fight him this time. That's a good thing. Yes, it is. Very, very good thing. Nobody there... likes the B.O.W. Oh, God. Yeah. And there's the... At least yep. he's in melee. And I'm shooting him with a gun because I won't need pistol bolts for a while. I won't even really need pistol bolts anymore. Yeah. There's a red compound. Like I said before, you want to check every single spot of this ship before before this sub. And there comes his best friend who's going, who's going. I'm gonna get you. You're gonna I got die. Item. You're gonna die. Dang it! He's in attack range. Ow. Ow. And he has oh. handgun bullets. Oh, that's useful. Oh, let me heal. Let me use a yellow. I think we're, we're pretty good on healing items for right now. Should be, should be. Haven't really used that many. And since this blue crowbar guy is going to be in my way, I know he is. Let's just shoot him. A couple of times there. Away he goes. Then we're going to start searching. Plan yourself for search everywhere around this ship. Cause you never know when you'll find something. Yes, you know who knows. You may find a healing animal. You may find Pepsi Man. You may even find Big Miss Prom. Oh, 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 oh. You might even find Tapir or someone. <laughs> <laughs> who knows? Oh, I you may thought... I mean, who knows? You may. I mean, you may even find. You may even find Who Framed Roger Rabbit around here somewhere. Oh God. <laughs> What were you saying before, though? Oh, um... I was gonna say, I have a perfect name for this game. Go Instead ahead. of calling it Resident Evil Gaiden, let's call it Resident Evil Titanic Edition. <laughs> that actually makes sense. This is kind of Titanic Edition there. So as you saw there, on the Periscope, it actually contains gas rounds. From what I know, those are the only gas rounds in the game. And as you saw, you saw the ultimate power of the gas grenade. Of the gas gun. I'm sorry, gas gun, not gas. Gas me. That's fine. Gas grenade are fine too, yeah. So we're gonna take out one blue zombie with a crowbar and we're gonna start searching around. As we search the torpedoes, there's Z tens for rocket launcher ammo. Yep. Apparently the rocket launcher is torpedo compatible. Must be. And then you kind of see everybody die from the zombies. Which once again makes you ask the question, where did they come from? Cotton Eye Joe? But see, there, there's, there's, there's Mr. B.O.W. He's just going... It's Bigamous it's, Prime! It's Bigamous Prime! Is he slowly Peter, walking? You say Pepsi Man and he wants to punch you. No, I'm gonna run away from you now, big. You cannot punch me. I show up, to say Pepsi Man, and drink Pepsi happily and smile laughingly and say yay. They save. And save. Now, before you check the third control console on the top there, we're gonna go and get some more items. Mm -hmm, from the. the end, you need lots of items. Yes, we're gonna grab some more items from the engine room. So we're gonna shoot up some more blue zombies, and once again they're in the crowbar range on me. As I now, as I now dead. 
So, check this, get some more handgun bullets. Completely useless at this point. Yes, we just did. damn near close. Uh -huh. And now we're in the engine room, as there's a blue zombie that holds something. And see, even though he's ran around the corner, and even though I should have target range on, as I said, as I said before, as I said before, you have to have, your character has to have eye coordination, I mean, eye coordination, has to have eye, eye line of sight. Damn, oh, critical mm -hmm. hit with that crowbar swing. Yep, and there's a purple herb. Mm-hmm, purple herb. Yep, purple herb. Almost wish they would have gave you some kind of longer range melee weapon to use. It would be nice, but hey, you know, it's Resident Evil. They always have, they always have knives. They never think about having a baseball bat or a sword or anything useful. So once you make sure you check everything, check that third computer to the right there or to the left, whatever way you come in. And so then Barry, who's not really tech savvy, figures out how to move the sub. So now we're starting to go back. He kind of apologizes to Lucia about what happened. And so Barry's like, oh, you know, I have a daughter about your age. If you want to, you can come live with us. She's like, oh, thank you so very much, Barry. So, now that we're going back to the starlight, it, it everything... Makes sense. She kind of looks like Barry, the hair color and stuff. So now we kind of think everything's hunky-dory. All we're going to do is find Leon and get out of here. Everything's fine. Every... Oh, crap. There he is again. And then before Barry can shoot him, he jumps back on towards the starlight again. So now we have to deal with Tyrant uh, for again. Don't you just love him? <laughs> He's a bastard, that's all he is. Yep, yep, yep. So now that we're back on the ship again, yeah, we're gonna call it a video for this. So once again, this is Ryu here. And Snorlag. Hope everybody enjoy. Stay tuned for the next video. Later.